Well, there's more than a thousand people here at Mount Hood Meadows. And while there's tons of advanced skiers and snowboarders, there's plenty of first timers too. Yeah, I'm, I'm feeling ready. After Mount Hood Meadows delayed the start of the ski and snowboard season for a week, close to 2,000 people hit ski lifts early Saturday. We had people in the parking lot at about 7 a.m. really wanting to get going. We don't open the lifts till 9. And on day one, beginners began pushing themselves to their limits. We just went off of that gnarly hill right there. And on any gnarly slope, there's ups Woo! There we go. and downs. After a while, one skier we caught up with, Matt Alfano, was ready to advance up to the Bunny Hills. I'm almost ready to try a chairlift, but we need Buzz Lightyear here. His friends, not so much. <laughs> but cut them some slack if they aren't ready to hang with hundreds of more advanced skiers. We actually got like roped into this trip a little bit. Like we were just like, we're going to the mountain to get like go skiing and I was like okay cool. The three didn't even plan to come to Mount Hood until a couple days ago. I rented this equipment two days ago and didn't know the season just started. We're just glad that we were able to get like tickets for yeah. the first day. Opening day. Got their tickets and are improving quickly. Nice. It was fun. Uh, didn't fall. I want to come back just to do skiing. <laughs> Though just like other skiers, the trio needed a break to hydrate. This wasn't the water break that we needed. Or something like that. Hey. Cheers. And if you do come out here for the first time, staff encourages you to take a lesson like this guy's doing. It takes about two hours and they'll get you on your way up the slopes. At Mount Hood, Tom Schultz, KGW News.